Welcome back to Boom Here TV! The main place to be! Today, right, we're going to be talking about storage hunters. Right, let me fill in the details if you didn't already know. Storage hunters are a very, very popular program. It's, it's being shown in 43 different countries around the world. Um, they first started in America, the concept started in America. Um, the storage hunters US, and then it came over to England where there was a UK version where yours truly was the main man, the boom leader. I was the main, the main character. I used to go in there and wind everyone up. King Kong boom, Ninja Jedi boom, 500 Monkey boom, Ninja Kawasaki boom, Pat Cash boom, you name it. If there was a way to describe a boom, I'd done it. Bullshit baffles brains. So I'd come in there, right, and I'd come in there and I'd come in, Ninja Kawasaki! Ninja boom! And it would just throw them off, throw them off their bidding. I ran them up, ran them up to the top, right? And then it then and then I then I then I I'll take my eyes on the prize. And that's it, that's all it's about, right? Yeah? It was a bidding game, right? Um I'm gonna talk about I'm gonna talk about the the, the, the main questions that I'm asked on the street of people because there's a there's a very popular show. Um it's still being repeated. Um it's all, it's been shown all around the world. It's a worldwide show. Um, very popular, very, very popular. Um, I think the UK one's better than the, I think the UK one's better than the US one. Let me know if you think differently in the comments below. But I think the UK one smashed the American one. The US one was good as well. You had Sean Kelly was he was auctioning it on the UK and the US one. But today we're gonna to be talking about we're gonna be talking about about you know the main questions what being asked. The, we're gonna debunk a few myths and we're gonna find out, you know, you know. Um, the main, the most asked questions about storage hunters. First question: Is storage hunters real? Right at the start of the show, it says storage hunters is recreated to make to to, uh, to make as a TV show. It's being recreated. So what, so what does that tell you? That tells you that it's a TV camera. There, there's only so many hours in a day. So you have to make your mind up about that. Think about it for a second. Um, the second question is, where did you get the name Heavy D or the Boominator? Heavy D, right, yeah, I, it was a nickname I had in school. Um, it was an 80s rapper, 90s rapper called Heavy D, Heavy D and the Boys. Um, he was, in, he was, he was, he was also, um, in a Juicy, um, um, you know the tune, he goes, um, um, Heavy D and, 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 and up in the limousine, yeah, that same Heavy D. So, um, sort of pepper Heavy D up in the limousine. Um, so basically, uh, I got, you know, uh, you know, my nickname, and then, then we, I went on the show, and then they said, What's your nickname from school? And I said, It was Heavy D, and that was it, really. It sort of stuck, Heavy D. Third question Where did Boom come from? Right, boom is like, it's a way of life, man. Boom, I've been saying boom for like near enough all my life. Boom, boom. I used to have the, the, the Batman pyjamas with the boom on it all over and the boom power and all that sort of stuff. So I've always liked just boom, so I've always like boom, boom, boom. You know what I mean? When I was raving in the 90s, it just go boom, boom. When I'm raving, go boom. So I've always said boom, boom's always been part of me. Uh, number four, number four, number four. How did you be? How did it come about to be on storage hunters? Um, that's you know what, right? Yeah, I was just in the right place at the right time, right? A right place at the right time. A friend of mine told me about um, storage hunters. Told me to come down with him and, and stuff, and the, and they said, and, and you know, they they saw quality. They saw they saw the way I wound it one up. As soon as I said the word boom, that was it. They said, yes, let's get him on the show. This guy's something else. He's different gravy. Let's have it. Number five, number five, number five. Where was the storage hunters? Where was it being shown? It was, it was storage hunters UK, so it was shown in every city. We went around all the cities. We went to Wales, we went to Scotland, we went all over, up north, Blackpool. We went Manchester, we went everywhere. You name it, we went all over the place. All over the south, Midlands, everywhere. We went, every single show was a different was shot in a different location. Right, number six. How, how, what was Nat, what was Nat like on the show? 
Nat, I'll tell you what, right, yeah, she was, she was, she was great, great value. I used to love winding her up. You know what I mean? She said, mate. I said, mate. She's got boom. She's got mate. I go, boom. Mate, those were epic battles. Epic battles, right, you know what I mean? On the, on the, you know, the, 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 you can't beat that. You can't beat that. That's what you call gold. Do you know what I mean? I come in right here. I come, and you know, it's, it's about everything. It's not just the booms. It's the, it's the, it's the attire, all right? You come in, you dress as a, dress as a Jedi. You come dressed as a ninja. You come dressed as, you know what I mean? Like all these different things, you just throw, throw them off. It's all that bullshit that baffles the brains. Um, who was your favorite in the show to wind up? Dumb and Dumber. They were brilliant, mate. They were fucking brilliant. You know the, you know the, 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 the two brothers? I used to love winding them up, mate. I tell you, they was good. They was good. Um, Linda I used to like as well. Linda's very good. I used to like her as well. She's good for every money. Not the sharpest tool in the box, but you know what? She is pretty smart. She's pretty smart. She's very business savvy. You know, but on the show, she wasn't the, 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 the sharpest tool in the box. Um, Ionia was very scary. She's very scary. Um, Nat. I'll tell you what, there was one time I swear she was gonna she was gonna she was gonna give me a, a bunch of fives, mate. Wait, I'm telling you. She was like proper wound up one time. Um, do you know what? It's just a great chemistry of great great characters. It was a great show. It's a great show, you know. It's a shame that they stopped it, but it was out of our control. You know, because they um I don't know the the real the, the actual reasons. I think it was because the last the last series they did it, it bombed. But nothing to do with me. Nothing to do with me at all. Number seven! Number seven. Um, number seven. Who designed all your outfits? Me, myself, and I. I you know what? I just like um, um, who designed my outfits and my and my suits. Gresham Blake designs my suits. Absolute mustard tailor down in Shoreditch. Amazing, right? Yeah. Um, he, you know, he's got so. I designed it from scratch. All my suits. All the outfits and all the ideas, you know, on storage hunters, I just come out of it. Most of it was just like a couple, a few couple of days before. I'd go and like sometimes I'd just go, just go and like get get the um, the um, the the. I, I, there's a lot of planning into it. Everyone just rock up, mate. I sort of take a lot of planning into it and a lot of dedication and a lot and a lot into it. Do you know what I mean? Because I know that I knew that I knew the effect it would have on all the others, you know. But my suits, absolutely love my suits from Gresham Bray. Absolute top tailor, check them out. Number eight, number eight, number eight, number eight, number eight, number eight. Um, what was Sean Kelly like? Sean Kelly like on camera and off camera? Sean Kelly, right, yeah, he's, he's, yeah, he's, he's, a, he's a comedian. He tells jokes. And he's, you know, we had some good banter. He's probably the only American person that I think has got a bit of banter, do you know what I mean? Um, you know, it's because, um, you know, Americans don't usually have banter, but he's got he's got he's got banter. You know what I mean? We used to have a good laugh. Uh, and you know what? It's all tongue in cheek. You know what I mean? It's all tongue in cheek. And stuff. I said, love you to kick me out of the auction. And then and then people, bring him back, bring him back, bring him back. And I come out like, I said, love that shit. All right, number nine. Number nine, number nine, number nine, number nine. Um, um, Mini Mile, do this to cut the lock. I used to love that. You remember the issue of the RG Barge? I said, I said, why not an RG Barge? I used to love all that. Um, yeah, but it was good. It was good. Um, it was good. He used to keep, keep us apart. You know what I mean? Keep, keep, all the, keep, keep the peace and stuff like that. Um, were the fights real? Yes, they were. Um, sometimes it really come to like fisticuffs and stuff and like whatever. And sometimes it really had to tone it down. And mini mold, some days he had to really earn his money. Do you know what I mean? Number 10. Number 10, um, this is the, the, the final question, final question, final question. Um, who, who, um, who's your most favorite on Storage Hunters? My fa most favorite, my most favorite, who was a bit like me, used to piss everyone off. Do you remember Dan from the first and second series? Oh, I used to like Dan. He used to piss everyone else off, very similar to me. Absolute diamond he was, but um, he wasn't in the third and fourth and the fifth series. But that's that. Let me know what you think. Let me know your comments and your questions. Make sure that you, you share, make sure you like, and make sure you subscribe. Make sure you comment. Boom there, TV, you know what time it is. Boom!